A growing concern about the homeless population at a public park in Lancaster. City police and other first responders say they are called to parks just about every night. Thanks for staying with us tonight. I'm Evan Forrester. And I'm Allie Bradley. Officials are saying that they're seeing an increase in reports of drug use, trash, and other disturbances at the parks. Fox 43's Grace Griffin has more from Bins Park in Lancaster. Bins Park is a popular place for homeless people to hang out, even sleep. Because it's covered, there's people bringing food throughout the day, and there's vents on the ground keeping people warm at night. It's not exactly home, but for some without a permanent place to live in Lancaster, they say it's all they have. Mainly I try to hang out here basically for the, air, um, the heat. Sometimes, um, mainly a lot, a lot of people for the food. Like sometimes I can't support myself for food. I just hold my money if I can actually get a room or just try to stay with somebody. Cisco saying he takes whatever job he can get, but can't always find shelter. Like the Water Street Mission, if you're trying to be in the program, you have to quit your job to stay there. The problem though, these people aren't actually allowed to be staying here. There are posted hours like you can't be in a public park after 10 o'clock and before six o'clock. So we have people sleeping in the parks. We have to deal with that enforcement effort. The congregation is not nearly as bad as the fact that there is some drug use. There's some uh, increased police calls for drug use, drug possession and drug selling among that group. I could probably walk down to Bins Park right now and, and I, I might come across someone who has or maybe is coming out of, of, of you know, a, a high right there and it happens all the time. And city officials say many are refusing the proper help. It's sort of a stubborn population, people who have been presented with options but who don't necessarily take them. And Lancaster County has no shortage of you know, availability and, and programs that can help people. It's just a matter of they have to want to do it. Every day, people in Lancaster are trying to help, dropping off food and clothing at Bins Park. But city officials say that's not the best way to support the homeless. They say rather try connecting with a legitimate shelter who has resources to help those in need. We have more information on those shelters on our website, fox43.com. In Lancaster, Grace Griffithin, Fox 43 News.